Hey guys, my name is Cecily Jamela and welcome back to This Week in Rideshare News. This week's stories include law firm confirms that they're negotiating a potential settlement with Uber, DoorDash provides 78 cents for hazard pay and reimbursement for PPE, and Uber announces boat service on the Thames River in England. And for my what would you do this week, a Lyft rider attacks a driver over a driver partition. Lycan and Liz Reardon are currently negotiating a potential settlement with Uber. They are now asking drivers in California and Massachusetts to make sure that they have your information on file. So definitely click the link, okay guys? Even if you previously received an arbitration settlement, you should contact them, especially if you continue driving for Uber after signing your settlement, you may be eligible for additional money that will cover the period after that. If you haven't signed up for the settlement or received money from the previous settlement, y'all need to make sure they have your information because they have some money waiting for you, okay? Secondly, Uber has also created a new financial assistance program for California drivers. Details of the program can be found at the link below. If you believe you or someone else in your household has been exposed to COVID-19 or have an underlying health condition or age 60 or over, you can receive $360 and stay home for three days. Now there's no documentation required for this and you can drive again after your three days. This program is supposed to end August 15th. So I do have information about the program. And, but if you did contract COVID-19, that's a completely different program. So DoorDash sent emails to San Francisco Dashers informing them that they would pay 78 cents a day as hazard pay in response to the city's April 21st emergency ordinance requiring on-demand delivery services to provide or reimburse employees for the reasonable cost of purchasing necessary hand sanitizer, disinfecting cleaning wipes, and any needed personal protective equipment such as gloves or face masks. 78 cents a day is clearly not enough to reimburse them for even like those cheap masks. And it's an insult to waste anybody's time for you to draft up a letter to send a note about 70 cents <laughs> like it's insulting to even use hazard pay in the same sentence as 78 cents i'm sorry doordash also launched dash mart it's an online convenience store offering household and retail items on dash mart you'll find thousands of convenience store items grocery restaurant items ice cream chips cough medicine dog food spice rubs and packaged desserts on restaurants Grubhub and Postmates, these guys just won't quit. Portland City Council passed a new ordinance capping fees on food delivery apps at 10%. Postmates and Grubhub are still taking fees up to 30% from local restaurants even after Portland City Council said to cap at 10. Grubhub claims that it is not a delivery company. They are a marketing engine and in response their public affairs director, Amy Healy, claimed that the company has already adhered to the 10% cap on fees, but the company claims that any additional costs were marketing fees, not delivery fees, right? You guys just don't know how to stop, man. Uber launches first commuter boat service on the Thames River. Commuters can now sell to work in London via boat as part of a fresh collaboration with departures from 23 piers across London from Putney to Woolwich. And now for my favorite segment, what would you do? The internet is split on how this driver handled this cancellation. Some feel that he antagonized the rider and others feel like the driver had a right to kick the guy out and the rider was out of line. Let me know your thoughts. Oh, put your mask on, man. You're supposed to be over there. Excuse me? You're supposed to be over there. You need to be out of my car. I'm, I'm not kidding. I'm going to cancel this ride. Why? Because I don't like the way you started it. Well, why? But saying that you're supposed to be over there? Yeah. I mean, it's either side, man. Pick up, pick up app. This side, this side had less cars on it. I don't understand. Uh, please leave. Okay. 
cancel the ride then. I will. As uh -huh. soon as you get out. Well, I, I don't want to leave till you do because then I won't pay for it. There you go, Danny. Go ahead, Garrett. Finished. Okay, there you go. I don't want this ride. Get out. Yeah. You're a fucker. Yes, sir, I am. Yeah. Wow, that's a shitty thing to do. Yeah, I know. I'm so glad that that's all on camera. <laughs> that's it for me this week. I'm here every single Saturday, so check me out. If you like this video, you saw something you like, give me a thumbs up. If you want to reach out to me, you can find me on my YouTube page, Drive Girl Drive, or Facebook, Drive Girl Drive. Be safe, stay blessed. Bye.